Hey, this is Jake with Survival News Online, and today I'm going to be showing you how to tie another lanyard, and I'm also going to show you part of my lanyard collection. So this is the lanyard I'll be showing you guys how to make today. It's really good for keychains and stuff like that. I really like it, it's got a cool design. To make this lanyard you're going to need two pieces of paracord and to make one about this long you're going to need two pieces about six feet. So what you're going to do is you're going to find the center of your two pieces. Then you're going to put your ring through one of them. And then what you're going to do is you're going to cross one side over and the other side over. So you've kind of so it looks like this. Then you're going to take the other piece at the center and put it through that loop that you made with the red piece. Then you're going to take one side of the black and put it over the near red and under the other one. So like this. And then you're going to flip the whole thing around and do the same with the other side. So you're going to take this black and it's going to go over this piece and under this piece. So it's going to look like this when you've tightened it down. And then you're just going to do the exact same thing all the way down until the lanyard is finished. So I'll show you again and it'll be easier to see uh, now that it's in, already in place. And it doesn't matter which side you cross over. So you just cross over the reds like this and you're going to make sure they're straight in line and then you'll take this black piece and you put it over this red and under this red and then flip the thing around take this black piece put it over this red and under this red just like that and then you just continue that weave all the way down the lanyard until it's finished and with the two colors it'll end up looking like this except you have a ring on it so that's it for that lanyard so these are a few of the lanyards that I've made this is the one I showed you how to make in the first video and so I've got a few of those and there's the double double stitched and the triple stitched this one is good for storing paracord and a lot of people will make belts out of them and I could do a video on that but it's pretty difficult to weave actually but it comes out fairly quickly so I might make a video on this one sometime uh, this is one that you see a lot at like summer camps and stuff like this a lot of kids know how to make these they're good for bracelets so and that's the same one there these are the ones I showed you how to make today and there's a couple of different things you can do with the color patterns I don't have one right now but you can make it if you use two colors you can make it solid like this on each side or you can make it to where it alternates so that looks pretty cool this one is a design that I came up with and it's really just basically tying a knot over and over and over on one long piece I think it looks pretty cool This is a variation of the one I showed you how to tie today, and it's really simple, but it looks completely different. Same thing with these. It's a very small change in the weaving process, and it ends up looking like this. So you've got these three right here, which are very, very similar, except it's just, it all comes down to the way you cross the, the, the cord when you're weaving it, and it's really interesting. Here's a lanyard that's pretty much just for decorative purposes but it looks pretty cool and here's another strictly decorative lanyard all right I hope you enjoyed the video let me know in the comments if you liked it and also comment and let me know if you want me to keep doing some more of these lanyard videos and stuff like that I know this is kind of a survival blog and uh, you know survival channel so I can start doing more videos on camping and survival skills and, and survival gear and stuff like that if you want. But I just thought I'd try doing a couple of lanyard videos and seeing how they do. Because, I mean, I, I like them. I think they're interesting. So let me know in the comments, and thanks for watching.